The community of Deerfield Beach, Florida, has been rocked by two horrific cases of teen violence. Five months ago, a 15-year-old boy was doused in rubbing alcohol and set on fire by his classmates. Now a 15-year-old girl is fighting for her life after allegedly being savagely beaten by a boy she'd never met after an apparent case of text rage. So how can you protect your children from bullying and violence? Here with some advice, we have author and bullying expert Rachel Simmons and clinical psychologist and Today Show contributor Jeff Gardier. Welcome. Such an important topic, although we should point out, as, as we saw earlier, it's not necessarily a trend. We've actually seen teen violence apparently Drop is dropping. But these are extreme cases. And, and Jeff, why do you think we are starting to see more of these? Uh, I think the reason we're starting, and we, and we think that about 30% of teens have either bullied or been bullied. Mm -hmm. So the statistics are still very high. I think part of it has to do with a lot of these kids may have some emotional issues going on. But more than anything else, what we're seeing in the schools, there's a lack of supervision, mm -hmm. especially during breaks. There's no culture against bullying, no set rules against bullying. And those are the things that are causing kids to come from troubled homes.